judge me? Not for a bit. I have nothing to say to you, but I want to question you. The question is, tell me who is Jim. Okay, but tell you what? Anything, but tell me point blank. Jim told of two young men which he didn't name and told the story of their friendship in Paris and how they met a certain girl. He told of not that one Jim, there he had to say his own name. He told of their friendship of their trip by the sea. Catherine saw that Jim remembered everything about her. She argued on a few points and added other details. Go on. That's all there is. There was the war. My joy seeing Jules again. My seeing you at the station. The happy days. I've spent with you here. What I've seen, what I've learned, what I've guessed. That pending cloud. I mean, Albert. Are you against me? No, not more than Jules is. Let me tell you my side of the story now. Jules conquered me with his generosity, his innocence, his vulnerability. He was such a contrast to other men. I tried to cure him of his insecurities, but I learned that they were all apart. We were happy, but our happiness did not last. And we became two people, not one. The war broke out. Jules went to the Russian front. He wrote me love letters, wonderful letters. I loved him again at a distance. He became a saint again. He left. Sabine was born nine months later. She doesn't look very much like Jules. Believe all you want. But she is his. I said, I gave you a child. That's enough. I want my own bedroom, my own freedom. I left. I've been back for three months. Jules is no longer my husband. Don't feel sorry for him. Just my presence is enough for him. I never told you everything. And neither did you. I understand. I don't want you to. It's almost done. from my life. The last time I saw you with her, you look like a couple. Love her, marry her, and let me see her. I mean, if you love her, don't think I'm an obstacle.
Lie down next to me. Kiss me. There's something I must tell you. It's rather long. Say it. I found a passage of a bag in a book. And a ship. A woman made love to a stranger in her mind. It struck me as a confession. It's how we explore the universe. I feel the curiosity too. Perhaps everyone does. I overcome it for your sake. But you don't. In love, I agree with you. India. Just look around you. You wanted something better. By refusing to submit to hypocrisy. You wanted to invent love. But pioneers must be humble and unselfish. Let's face it, we have failed in everything. You tried to change me. I've tried to spread joy, but I have only created pain. I promised to marry Gilbert, but I can't postpone my promise. End this one. It's contrary. I have no longer any hope of marrying you. Happily, I'm going to marry you, baby. You still have children. What a beautiful story, Jim. But what about me, Jim? You didn't want any. I did. They would have been beautiful, Jim. found out that you were easy to get and hard to keep. Your love vanished and returned with that of Catherine. I never knew those ups and downs. Mr. Jim may have something to tell you. Will you come with me? Watch us, Jules. Thank you.